Hey everyone, in this video I'll be reviewing this fuse block from Blue Sea Systems. The purpose of a fuse block, such as this one, is to distribute DC power from your leisure batteries to each of your DC power devices. For example, LED lights, a ventilation fan, fridge, and water pump. Let's get into the details of this device. This is what the fuse panel looks like when you first receive it. It comes with a nice, hard plastic cover that you can remove by pushing the yellow button at the top. When you remove this cover, you can see the main positive and negative terminal posts that connect to your batteries. The panel as a whole can accept a max current of 100 amps. This fuse panel allows you to create 12 individual DC circuits with a maximum of 30 amps running to each circuit. In the middle of the unit is where you find the positive lines for each circuit. The fuse panel allows you to add standard automotive fuses like this one to each circuit to protect your electrical wiring from overheating and potentially catching on fire. In the top third of this panel is where you'll find the negative lines for each individual device. Now I'll show you how to connect wire terminals to this fuse panel. Officially, the main positive and negative terminals accept number 10 size ring connectors, but they'll also take quarter of an inch copper lugs. In this example, I'll be using a quarter of an inch lug that fits 2 watt wire. To make the connection, you'll want to crimp a copper lug or ring connector onto your wire, then remove the hex nut and place the copper lug over the terminal and fix the hex nut back into place. You want to do the same with the negative terminal. For the branch circuits that lead to each individual device, you will need number eight size ring connectors. Here we have a number eight connector that fits 14 to 16 gauge wire. To connect a DC device to the fuse panel, you'll need to crimp this ring connector onto red wire and connect it to one of the positive screws. So that's what we're gonna do here. We're gonna remove one of the positive screws, place the screw through the ring, and put it back into place. And once fixed, we're gonna do the same with the black wire. You wanna crimp this ring connector onto the black wire and pick one of the negative screws, remove the screw, fit it over the ring connector, and put back into place. And once you've made all your connections, you can place the plastic cover back over the panel. This Blue Sea Systems panel also comes with handy labels so that you can identify each individual circuit. This can be particularly handy when you're wiring lots of different DC devices. You just write the name that each circuit is heading to, like a fridge or a ventilation fan, and place a sticker in the appropriate placed groove. Our only two criticisms of this product is that it doesn't come with any screws for mounting the product onto the surface material, and it only comes with one fuse. And for the price of this product, you'd think that they would supply some, but they don't. So you'll need to get your own screws and fuses to complete this project. But other than that, we've had this particular DC fuse block in our camper van for over four years and really love the quality and recommend them. Building an electrical system in a camper van can be complicated. Just look at all the products that you'll need. That's why we provide an electrical wiring ebook filled with simple, intuitive wiring diagrams and product and tool recommendations to help you build your system as fast as possible. To access this free ebook, click the link in the description below or head over to our website's homepage. Happy building.